Hello everyone, this is Mamta Moon and today we will learn and solve questions 1 to 10 of exercise 9a, chapter 9. Chapter name is Ratio and Proportion of Class 6 of Composite Mathematics Textbook. Let's get started and solve some questions. Today we will learn and solve exercise 9a, questions 1 to 10 of chapter 9. Chapter name is Ratio of Proportion and Unitary Method. And topics are concept of ratio, simplest form of a ratio, equivalent ratios, and simplifying ratios. Let's solve some questions. Now question number 8. The length of a rectangular frame is half meter and the width is 3 divided by 4 meter. What is the ratio of width to that of the length? Options are 3 is to 2, 1 is to 3. 2 is to 3 and 1 is to 2. So ratio of width to that of length. Width divided by length is width is 3 divided by 4 and length is 1 divided by 2. 3 4 divided by 1 is to 2. 1 divided by 2. Now 3 divided by 4 multiplied with 2 is divided by 1. So cancelling 2 and 4. 2 multiplied by 2 is 4. Now we get 3 divided by 2. That is 3 is to 2. 3 is to 2 is answer. So option A is the correct option. So the ratio of width to, uh, to that of length is 3 to 2. So option A, 3 to 2 is the answer. Option A, 3 to 2 is the correct answer. Now we will solve question number 9. High order thinking skill horse question. What is the ratio of the number of prime numbers to the number of composite numbers between the numbers 1 to 5, 1 to 50? with 1 and 50 included. So first we have to find the prime numbers between 1 and 50. Prime numbers which have only two factors that is 1 and the number itself. So prime numbers between 1 and 50 are 2, 3, 5, 7, 11, 13, 17, 19, 23, 29, 31, 37, 41, 43, 47. These are the prime numbers between 1 and 50. So, num so number of prime numbers are how many numbers? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. number of numbers is 50. Now consonant uh, composite numbers are Now composite numbers between 1 and 50 will be total, total numbers are 50, so we have to subtract 50 minus 
Now, what is the ratio of the number of prime numbers? So, ratio of number of prime numbers divided by numbers of composite numbers. Prime number is 15 and composite number is 39. So 15 is to 39 is the answer. 34. We got number of composite is 49 minus 15 which is 34. So number of ratio of the number of prime numbers to the number of composite numbers is 15 is to 34. Now we will solve high order thinking skill hearts question, question number 10. Ankita is 18 years old and her brother Apurv is 16 years old. What is the ratio of Ankita's age to Apurv's age? And what will be the ratio of Apurv's age to Ankita's age after 8 years? So first we have to find out what is the ratio of Ankita's age to Apurv's age. So ratio of Ankita's age Apurv's age. Ankita age is 18 years and Apurv's age is 16 years. Now between 18 and 16, 2 is the common ratio. So divide the antecedent 18 with 2 and the consequent 16 with 2. 18 divided by 2 is 9 and 16 divided by 2 is 8. 9 is to 8. So 9 is to 8, 9 is to 8 is the ratio of Ankita's age to Apurv's age. Now we have to find the Apurv's age, ratio of Apurv's age to Ankita's age after 8 years. after 8 years Ankita age after 8 years Apurv's age after 8 years will be 16 years plus 8 years 16 plus 8 and Ankita's age will be 18 plus 8. So 16 plus 8 is 24 and 18 plus 8 is 26. Between 24 and 26 years. 
between 24 and 26, 12 is 2 is the common ratio. So divide the antecedent 24 with 2 and the consequent 26 with 2. Now 24 divided by 2 is 12 and 26 divided by 2 is 13. So 12 is to 13 is the ratio of Apurv's age to the Ankita's age after 8 years. So 12 is to 13 is the answer. So ratio of Ankita's age to Apurv's age is 9 is to 8 and ratio of Apurv's age to Ankita's age after 8 years will be 12 is to 13. Keep learning, keep watching and please visit my blog maxgrade.com. Link is in here. HTTPS www. This is my blog link. And join my telegram group. This is my telegram group link. And if you have not subscribed my youtube channel then please subscribe my youtube channel and hit the bell icon for getting notifications of future videos. Keep learning, keep watching and please subscribe my youtube channel. Thank you. If you like this video then please click the like button and share this. If you have not subscribed my youtube channel then please subscribe my youtube channel and hit the bell icon for getting notifications of future videos. If you have any doubts then please write in comment section and I will reply. Keep learning, keep watching and thanks for watching. Please subscribe my youtube channel. Thank you.